Well, guys, good morning. <laughs> good morning. It's been a morning, but we're here. <laughs> so, um, currently, we are in Peachy Parking, Airport Parking. Uh, it was a struggle this morning. I wasn't struggling. It was a struggle this morning. We're late. He we caught struggling. some traffic. We caught some traffic, and, um, it's currently 8.15, flight leaves at 9.45. We're waiting on the international shuttle to come pick us up, take us there, and we're just praying everything goes smooth. And that's all we can do at this point. But we're here on our way to Dominican Republic. Again. Again, but a different resort. Celebrating our 10 year anniversary tomorrow. And we are so excited. God has been good to us. Um, we've been making it do what it do with the help of God. So, um, yeah. Thank you for stopping by again. If you've been here before or if it's your first time, um, like, subscribe, hit the notification button, and um, leave a comment. We'll get back to you. So we'll see you when we finally arrive, hopefully. We'll see. We'll see. But we'll be back. What is happening right now? It's morning time. I don't know. I need uh, some coffee. Coffee? No. I hate coffee. But, um, yeah, guys. We'll see you guys in a minute. Coffee. All right, guys. So we missed our flight. And we are on standby for the next flight, which leaves at 8.13. Um, our original flight was leaving at 9.45, but- 11.13? You said 8.13. I think I said it that way. The next flight is leaving at 11.13. So yeah, we're here just waiting um, to be assigned a seat. And somebody wanted breakfast which is nothing new. It looks good, but I'm good. <laughs> so It actually is good. Right. So um, we'll see you guys once we arrive in Dominican Republic. All right, peace. Well, guys, unfortunately, we missed our flights. So that's the end of this video. I'm sorry. Um, thank you guys for coming by. I know it was such a short video, but I'm playing. <laughs> so we got home. Um, something in me wanted to try one last time. So I got on the phone with Delta Vacations and this particular rep, um, she went over and beyond to make it happen. So she called Delta herself and they found a flight the next day into Santo Domingo, which is two hours from Punta Cana. So we flew into Santo Domingo and we booked a two hour shuttle from Santo Domingo airport to Punta Cana airport. And we took our original shuttle from Punta Cana to our hotel, which was only like 15 minutes away. So. We're going to start here at the next morning, getting on the flight the next day. All right. Y'all enjoy the video. Peace. <music> Thank you. 
back on that. Mm -hmm. Get back on that. This is my new favorite spot outside on the, what's this? Patio. It's a patio. Look, they're playing a song for us. I believe it's over. Yes. <laughs> what's going on, guys? So, it's been a long day, long process, um, as you've seen, but nevertheless, we're here, checked in. Um, we chilled out once we checked in and got in the room. And now it's about 8.10 and it's dinner time. Finally. Right, finally. I so was <laughs> <laughs> Tonight is our official anniversary. Um, we wanted to do the beach dinner, but because of the missed flights and the just now getting here, they wasn't able to make it happen tonight. So we're going to do that another night. But um, yeah, all of the restaurants are here are pretty great. Um, I think we're gonna check out the steakhouse. So yeah, let's go get into this food and see what it's like. Anything you want to say? I have nothing to say. Happy anniversary. Right, happy anniversary. <laughs> all right, guys, we're out. Peace. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ooh, so good. So this is what is this? This is the short ribs tacos. And this is the artichoke dip. We both got pork, not pork. No, we some both kind got, of tacos. You got right, We both got short wave tacos. tacos. Um, I have a special drink. I wanted something <laughs> special. She has a version pina, pina colada. Pina colada, cause y'all know pina colada is my drink. Virgin, virgin pina colada. Hey, what would you say one of the lessons you've learned in our ten years of marriage. That's a good one. I learned a lot of lessons. No. Um, basic. I mean, one of the basic ones. You can't be selfish. It's not always about yourself. You have to think about the other person and consider how they feel, you know, kind of put yourself in their shoes when it's a moment where, you know, you're okay, but the, the other person, your spouse, is not okay. So you have to kind of like change your mind and not think about yourself and put yourself in their shoes and, you know, consider their feelings and what you would do if or how you would want the other person to feel or what you would want them to do if you was in their shoes. So, what are one of the lessons you have learned in after 10 years of marriage? Um, I would say one of the greater lessons I've learned after 10 years of marriage is I'm continuously learning is that don't feel like you have to do things on your own and be very on your own. And that can be especially challenging for someone like me who's grown up to be just a very independent person um, and then just learning to be vulnerable, emotional, um, 
and just learning to share whatever burden it is that I have mentally, emotionally, spiritually with you and just continuously being able to do that, you know. Um, because it surprised me every time that I do, you know, just how strong you are for me and help me to be in the encouragement. So, learning to really depend and trust my husband. Yeah, great that's my life. All right, guys, I have the ribeye ingus, and I have one of these sauces is That's the mushroom. Mushroom, some kind of mushroom, cream of mushroom. Cream of mushroom. That's the chimichurra product. And this is the chimichurra sauce. But yeah, we're going to try it. They got filet mignon. It's supposed to be blue cheese, but it looks like a mushroom sauce. Yeah, yeah. Your filet mignon looks good. And we got corn, coleslaw, baked potato. Let's dig in. Cheesecake, apple crumble pie. guys we are done with dinner and we are currently at the um, outside theater some kind of musical show is supposed to be happening and we're just sitting here waiting um, it's supposed to start at 9 30 um, it's past 9 30 so yeah we're just sitting here waiting to the show starts we got a, a little mini walk how far was that walk like five minutes yep. Not no. Yeah, we got a little walk in, two minute walk to burn some of these calories. <laughs> but yeah, we're here just waiting on the show. Um, the theater is located in between the uh, adults only side and the family side, yeah. so there are kids out here, which is kind of refreshing to see some kids um, around. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we're about to see the show. All right. from dinner and the little show the show was funny <laughs> what well it was funny it was but funny. that's because we were being silly yes and i was kind of drifting off falling asleep but anyway <laughs> it was cool food was good it really was um i'm tempted to order room service just to see what it's like but I don't know. We will see. <laughs> but yeah, we just glad we made it. We had an awesome time getting here. We had some struggles, as you guys seen, with us missing our flights. But we're glad we're here. We're gonna. We make, made it. Yes. Yes, we're gonna make the best of it. We had to travail to get here. Yeah. 
<laughs> but um, yeah, we almost didn't make it. That's another story for another day. Right, exactly. But mm-hmm. we're here, so we're gonna close this thing on out. So we thank you guys for joining us. Make sure you give us some feedback, comment, like, and subscribe. Suggestions for where our next trip should be. That would be really cool. Hmm, yeah, maybe. Yeah. But um, yeah, I'm still a growing channel, so it would be great if you guys would hit those like buttons and subscribe. It would definitely help my channel. And um, we will see you guys tomorrow. tomorrow. All right, have a good one. Good night. Peace. Good morning, guys. So, we're up. We ordered room service. Mm -hmm. Um, And, yeah, we're eating our room service breakfast. Um, Today, um, we're probably just going to chill by the pool, you know, relax, get a couple of drinks and whatnot. Um, Last night, like we said before, it was pretty good. but yeah, we're just enjoying this good breakfast. <laughs> we ordered a lot of food, but it's well, that's just because we wanted to try different things. There's no way we're actually eating all of this. Yeah, but um, yeah, and we'll see what else today's bring us. Um, I think we have to schedule our COVID test to um go back to the U.S. today. And yeah, we're just going to chill and explore the property. So good morning to you all or good afternoon or whatever. (laughs) Whatever time of day it is you're watching this vlog. But um, yeah, and that's about it. We will see you guys later. See you later. Headed to the beach, or pool. the pool, <laughs> whatever. Somewhere. Just, right, somewhere. We just scheduled a COVID test and handled some other business, and we are headed down to the beach or the pool, like she said. Whatever. <laughs> beach, pool, some kind of water and sunshine and Feels amazing. It feels great. Babe, it's not cold. It's not cold. Come on. Babe, this water feels amazing. Once you get in it, you not have to warm up. <gasps> I'm freezing. This 
water is not cold. Yes, though. it. When you first step in it, yes, it is cold. You have to let your body get acclimated to the temperature. It's cold. guys we got some food here um while well, chilling at the pool the pool felt amazing the pool felt Let's amazing get in it. but yeah we got some food let me show you what we got wife we got a salad chicken wrap some corn and salad fried chicken wrap I've never heard of that. I've had that. It's literally fried chicken. Fried chicken wrap. And of course, pizza. The third. Let's dig in. Margarita. No. Daiquiri. Daiquiri. Mango daiquiri. 